What's going on, you revolutionists, and welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having a great day today. But oh my god, did you guys just watch the COD XP global briefing for stuff like multiplayer reveal for Infinite Warfare, Infinite Warfare, Piece of the Story Mode, and also Modern Warfare Remastered? Oh my god, this year in Call of Duty is going to be insane. They also show the DLC for Salvation trailer, which is really nice. But today, we're going to be covering the multiplayer review for Infinite Warfare. Hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you do, definitely leave a like on the video. Definitely subscribe to the channel, because I'm going to be bringing you guys a ton of Call of Duty content from multiplayer to story mode to zombies. This year is going to be insane with content. All you content creators, we're going to have a blast. But let's get right into the Infinite Warfare multiplayer review trailer. player beta all right guys oh my god that video the multiplayer re reveal trailer was insane i love the music that they put it. it gave you such an adrenaline rush when you're watching it but let's go through it there's a little key notes that i found so here obviously that's beginning shows all the soldiers this is look at them look how majestic they look you got like the robot guy you got, I believe that's more like the assassin person. You got like the heavy gunner, machine gunner guy, marksman person. I, this is more of the assault leader. And then you have like the support looking guy right here. And then obviously you have like this little kill streak they're using. Let's go back. That kill streak looks insane. Look at this. Oh my god. Okay. And then here we're going to go through the players itself. Here, Here's a, one of the first guys. I believe his name is... Oh, his name is Warfighter. Okay, his name is Warfighter. I want to make sure I got that correct. His combat style, he's a mid-range assault. Oh my god, it's going to be crazy. His payload right now, he's currently using the Claw, which is a rapid-fire sped shot firearm with ricochet ballistic rounds designed to take out the enemy in front of you and around blind corners. Aim down sight for more focused damage. Wow. And his trait is ping that he's currently using is kills and assists activate a sonar ping at the enemy's death location. Revealing nearby hostiles to teammate enemies killed by teammates after being pinged while giving you a bonus score. That's crazy. His primary weapon, I'm going to back it up just so I can get a better picture of it. His primary weapon, I, it looks nasty still. His primary weapon is the NV4 Vigilance, which is, right now it's a rare it says. I guess that's just like the type of stuff he has and that makes it a rare. But that's more like the M4A1 if you guys have ever used that in any Call of Duty. Uh, his gun perk is a sharpshooter, which is increased damage range and stocked with a rifle barrel. So I read that correctly, and that's pretty warfighter. He looks cool. That's probably the mostly the character I like to be. I like being a mid-range assault rifleist. As you can see when I play Black Ops 3, that's mostly what I do. 
And here's some gameplay with it as well. He's just going off with that NV4. And he pulls out that gun. It just looks incredible. Look at that. And here you have Striker, which is the tactical support player. And his primary weapon is the Type 2 Frenetic. I believe I said that correctly. The gun perk he's using on it is Steady, which is reduced hip spread stocked with laser sight. So that's that's pretty cool. To me, that's like a gung-ho type perk. Or a gun perk, yeah. The trait he's using is the trophy drone. It will damage and come here. Let's read that a little better. I kind of, it's kind of all staticky. So, okay, it says, will destroy uh, one incoming lethal grenade and then something, I can't really read that because like a little, like, net. Oh, okay, and slowly, then slowly charged, recharged. Okay, so there we go. I read that better now. I really couldn't see because it's like, little staticky on my screen his payload is a gravity vortex gun is a prototype launcher that fires a slow moving projectile which distorts gravity pulling in and damaging enemies damn what what would that be like in the game let's i can't wait to find out because it'd be insane and then we go on here some more gameplay this guy's just whipping ass right now wow this guy's going hard look at that look at that rocket sweet jesus that's a black hole, oh my god. And now we have Phantom, which is the marksman character. His payload is usually currently using that active camo, which renders you almost invisible. We obviously know that from Black Ops 3. His primary weapon is a KBS longbow stasis. I believe I said that correctly. Uh, his gun perk is focus, which is reduced idle sway while aiming down sight. Uh, his trait is called marked target, which is damaging enemies will mark them for death. Preventing health regeneration for several seconds. Marked enemies that are killed by teammates will reward you with a random bonus score. That's pretty cool. So this is what he looks like. He looks like a total badass. And then we go on. Here's just some sniping. This is going to be... I think a lot of like the sniping community is going to like this a lot. Here's a guy that acts camo. And then next we have Merc, which is a heavy infantry. The payload he's currently using is bullet charge, which is charge forward, leveling all enemies in your path. So that's like the ballistic shield, but like totally futuristic. His trait is a shockwave, which press a button in midair to activate random devastating slam. Or a devastating slam. Damn, that's crazy. Uh, primary weapon is a titan scout, which is like a machine gun. Obviously, is an epic, which is crazy. And his gun perk is hacks. Which this weapon has a custom hack site, which I, I don't know how, what that would be, but let's, I can't wait to find out when the game fully reveals, comes out, and all that. It's going to be nuts. But here we go. We digress on through the trailer. This guy is just knocking people down. I Here he throws like a force field that his teammates go in. Here he's just knocking people down with that shield. Jesus. And then here we have FTL, which is an assassin. And... His payload is an FTL jump, which is a localized FTL burst that moves you a short distance forward, which is, I can see that more of like, if you guys ever played Halo, that little burst forward that you can have, I, that's what it's mostly like. His trait is a power slide, which is enhanced sliding capability that increases speed distance and allows you to aim down sights while sliding, also has a diminished something cost. I really can't read this. Oh, diminished boost cost. Okay. There we go. I read it better now. And then, let's back it up just a little bit so I can get a better image on... Well, I really can't get a better image. Let's go a little... Well, his primary weapon is a Banshee Rocksteady, which is... I think that's the shotgun. That's crazy. His gun perk is stability, which is reduced recoil and, you know, just looking forward so he doesn't have a lot of recoil. We see that. And then here we digress to the thing. Here, this is Uplink. Look how beautiful the Uplink is looking. Look at that. Wow. That's crazy. And now here we have Synaptic. I believe I said that correct. Uh, correct. I can't even speak right now. Wow. But okay, I believe I said that correct. Synaptic. The combat style is a close quarters combat. His payload is currently used Reaper, which is switched to a rapid melee combat mode. Which I'm not too sure because it's not like it's saying it's like oh, you have a big gun. But we'll find out. Uh, his primary weapon is an Erad Severus, which is an epic. His gun perk is a master key, which is underbarrel shotgun with rejuvenating ammo. Wow. I don't know how people or how you guys are feeling about that, but when I see rejuvenating ammo, it's like, eh. Then you're taking away from, like, what is it, scavenger and all that. 
and his tray is rushed down, which is press A button to quickly dash in any horizontal direction. So basically left and right, stuff like that, okay. So here we go, we got more gameplay here for you guys. Look at this. It looks really cool. I'm not I'm not gonna badmouth this game at all. And then look at what was that? Let's go back. That dude is running like a dog. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh my god. And here we just have some more gameplay. Just crazy kill streaks. Everything stuff's just popping off. Look at that. Oh my god. But that's basically the reveal trailer. Here we go. Call of Infinite Warfare available for pre-order disc and digital download. November 4th, 2016. Look at this. A crafting prototype. Look at look, let's go back to that quickly. Wow. So look at that. You got like E Rat, SMG, full auto energy, desperation, mu uh, muzzle, dampens, recoil, high accuracy, and clash. You got common, rare, legendary, and epic. And just the way it is, it just changes. It changes it from a common all the way through the ranks to an epic. And then the gun perks you have on it is master key, underbarrel shotgun, and stability, reduced recoil. Comes with a stock and a free grip. A foregrip. There we go. Stock with foregrip. Wow. Oh my god. I, I This is crazy. You can pre-order and get the beta access. Beta begins... October 14th, 2016, first on PlayStation, and then I believe probably like a week later it'll come on Xbox, just so everybody can experience it together. And then you pre-order, obviously, and you get Terminal Bonus Map and Zombies in Spaceland Pack. Oh my god, that Zombies in Spaceland, I'm such a huge zombie fan. I'm just going to be a huge fan of this game because there's so much to offer the player. It's just crazy, but... Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Definitely leave a like on it if you did. Definitely subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be bringing you guys a ton of Call of Duty content that ranges from story mode to multiplayer to zombies. And definitely subscribe if you guys enjoy this stuff. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.